In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to change the mouse speed, otherwise known as mouse sensitivity, on your Chromebook, so that the cursor will move around the screen faster or slower than it normally would. To do this, you need to open up the Settings app, and the easiest way to do that is to click on the time in the bottom right hand corner, and then click on this settings icon down here. And now in the settings app, in this left hand menu here, you'll need to click on device here. And now this is where it can get a bit different depending on what you're using. Because the settings for the trackpad and the settings for a separate traditional mouse are in two separate menus, which means you actually have two separate speed settings for your trackpad and for a real mouse, if you have one connected. So first, Tamir will show you how you can change the speed of your mouse cursor when you're using your Chromebook's trackpad. And after that, Tamir will show you how you can also control the separate speed for a separate traditional mouse like this, if you have one. To change the speed for your trackpad or touchpad, as it's often referred to. In this device menu here, you'll need to find touchpad here. It might be the top option if you don't have a mouse connected, but you should find touchpad and you'll need to click on that to go in here. And now we have all the settings to control the touchpad. And you need to look down near the bottom of this menu here and you should find touchpad, touchpad speed here. And next to that, we basically just have a slider where you can slide it to be faster or slower. So right now it's in the middle, so it's about half speed, but we could drag it all the way, just click and drag all the way to the fast side. So now it will move across the screen really quite fast without you moving very much on your trackpad at all. Or you can click and drag it all the way to the other end to be really slow. And now it will move across the screen screen quite slowly, even with you moving your finger on the trackpad fairly fast and aggressively. And obviously those are the two extremes. More realistically, you might want to do something like that to have it not the slowest speed possible, but just a bit slower than normal. Or you could also go to somewhat faster if you want. It's really all up to you like that. And there's also this setting here called touchpad acceleration. So that basically means if you physically move your finger across the trackpad faster, the cursor will move faster. So it's usually on by default already, and it's probably best to leave it on. It kind of feels more intuitive that way. But if you are trying to make your mouse cursor move quite a lot slower, you might want to consider turning this off when you turn it right down. And then no matter how fast or how much you move your mouse, your finger on the trackpad, the cursor will only be slower. Or if you set it to fast, it will only be fast even if you move it really slowly. So it's kind of making it more extreme there. It is more intuitive and easier to use if you have it turned on. But for a very specific circumstance, if you need it to be a bit different, you can try turning that off and see if that works better for you. So it's really all down to personal preference here. You probably want to play around with it a bit and try a few different speeds and try it with the switch on and off. It's really just seeing what works best for you and for your specific trackpad. But you can have a play around with that until you get it kind of the way you want it. And then you're pretty much done. If you only have, if you only use a trackpad on your Chromebook, you could really just close the settings app now and use your trackpad the way it's now configured. But if you also have an external mouse that you use with your Chromebook, even if it's not all the time, maybe just sometimes, and you also want to change the speed for that, you need to go back out of the touchpad menu here, back to this device menu in settings, and you'll need to find the mouse option. It should be the option at the top of the screen here, but it will only appear if you currently have a mouse connected. So if your mouse isn't connected, you probably won't see it here. Just make sure your mouse is connected and then you should see a mouse option here and you can click mouse. And now it's really pretty much the same as the settings for the trackpad. 
we have cursor here with cursor acceleration and cursor speed. So we just have this slider here, it's currently in the middle, but we can click and drag it over to fast. And now the cursor will move around the screen really quite fast without you having to move the mouse very much. Or you could drag it all the way to slow and now the cursor will move around the screen a lot slower. And obviously you could do any other variation you want, maybe drag it to there or something, depending on what you want. And there's also cursor acceleration. So just like with the trackpad, with this being on by default, if you move your mouse faster, it will still move the, the mouse cursor faster, even though you have it set to slow. But if you turn this off, no matter how fast you move the mouse, it's just going to move the cursor fairly slowly. So it's up to you what you want to do here. You might want to try with it on or with it off and see what works best for your setup. But if you are trying to get the mouse really slow for some reason, you probably want to turn that off because it will help you to have a really slow mouse. But it is, it kind of usually works more intuitively if you have this turned on. So Timmy would probably recommend it turn, being turned on. And Timmy's probably going to have it set to fairly fast like this. But it's really all personal preference, so you want to play around with a few different speeds and try that being on or off and see what works best for you. And different mouse, different mice are going to work differently, so see what works best for your mouse as well. But once you're happy with that, that's really all there is to do it. And because a mouse has a scroll wheel, you will also have a scrolling speed setting here where you can control the speed that it, the scroll wheel will scroll if you want to. You'll have to turn on controlled scrolling to be able to control the scrolling speed. But then just like the cursor speed, we can make it go faster or slower. And we can't really demonstrate it in here that well. But maybe if we pull up a website, you can see with it on slow to me scrolling quite a lot and it's only very slowly moving down the page. But if we were to set it to quite fast and go back here, now just a very small movement on the scroll wheel makes it scroll a lot on the page. So really very similar to the cursor settings. But you can change that if you want. And then once you're happy with all that, you're really done. You can go back out of here and probably even close the settings app and just use your trackpad or your mouse at whatever new speed settings it's set to. Just remember, the mouse settings only apply to this specific mouse. So at some point in the future, if you disconnect this mouse and connect a different mouse, you will probably want to come back into the settings and change the speed for that new mouse. But apart from that, you're all good to go. So that's all there is to this video. But Tommy also has another video where Tommy walks you through all the different customization options for how your mouse works with your Chromebook. So if you're interested in that, you can watch that video here. But apart from that, Tommy might see you in another video in the future.